you know, I was just reading about this Dylan's rule. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, for the origins of this rule, see uh, John F. Diligent. Yeah. Dylan. Uh -huh. The law of municipal corporations. Mm -hmm. There's a doctrine that a unit of local government may exercise only those powers. Yeah. <laughs> that the state expressly grants to it. Mm -hmm. Now, the powers necessarily and fairly implied from that grant uh, and the powers that are indispensable to the existence of the unit of local government. Mm. Now, I'm going to have a look at this Dillon's rule. Yes, I personally am. Poop. Because every time you issued a forged document as a city, mm -hmm. as a county, Jefferson and Clown County, yes, uh, and even as a state, Washington State, mm -hmm. Uh, the doctrine would say that the local government has exercised powers that they don't have. Yes. Now, when you issue a protection order, Brent Basin, mm -hmm, where there's a forgery and the forged document. Yes. And it's been used to have me arrested multiple times. Yes. Um, there is the possibility of very large lawsuits for the state refusing mm -hmm, to remove your power necessary to issue court orders. Yes. Now, the Supreme Court justices that are very much complicit in your solicitation of crime mm -hmm. so that you can employ prostitutes to come to find out. Yes. So that you can move that money from wherever it's going to move from. Yes. I would say that I could sue this state and every state for this doctrine mm -hmm, of a unit of local government may not exercise any power mm -hmm, that the state has granted to it. Yes. When they have any knowledge of forged documents, mm -hmm. forgery signatures, oh, felony conspiracy, yes, and criminal solicitation. Mm -hmm. Now, I know you're saying, well, he's a homeless man. He can't do anything. Mm -hmm. But I'll sue. Get me a copy of that. Uh, Dylan's uh, Law of the Municipal Corporation. Mm -hmm. See, you're incorporated, aren't you? Yes. Mm -hmm. And your 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 county corporation, yeah. City incorporation, poop. Municipal corporation, yes. You know the thought of you using forged documents to accomplish your crimes, yes. It does violate your incorporation of municipality, poop. <laughs> now, as much as we wouldn't want to lose all the states in the state of Washington, poop. <laughs> Because I'll sue every sheriff's department that has any knowledge of the issuing of forged documents. <laughs> and then when I go through their individual counties, yes, if they've been doing what you've been doing as Jefferson and Clallam County, yeah, I'll sue to have them removed. Yeah. Now, it is quite possible that a state doesn't need counties or cities. Oh, <laughs> and we could just have one big state known as Washington State. Oh, <laughs> and then we could go back to, is it the Organic Act or the State of Incorporation? Let's go ahead. You know, we might just have one big nation that has one big state, all 50 of you. <coughs> now, it does violate the incorporation powers of any county. <laughs> and as important as you might seem that you are, <laughs> every time I find a forged document, yes, <laughs> where it was the power of the state that granted you the authority to issue those documents. <laughs> <laughs>